Hey, internet friends, Steve from Steve K's Vaping World here. We've got some new products from Mom, oh, from Wow Vapor by Vapor for Life. Uh, so let me turn these all right side up while you watch the intro. So Well Vapor is kind of a sister brand to Vapor for Life. I'm not exactly sure of the positioning of it. Pardon me while I shuffle around to get in the right spot. Um, they're all, they've got a few things in their stable. What they've sent me are their new Wild disposables, um, kind of aimed directly at the smokers market. I've also got the new Dial of Volt and Vapor Zeus, which you've seen me review already, but I'll tell you why these are a little different. Um, I've also, of course, got color-coordinated smile amizers to go with it, and we'll run through those just real quick because they're not much different than the originals. Uh, let's take a look first at the disposable. Um, they come in two levels, like strong and regular, as well as uh, menthol and traditional. Pretty much, uh, you know, standard disposable fare. Comes in a little thing that's kind of like a cigarette flip-top box. If you open that up. Um, it comes with a handy information guide because um, again you know these are going to be brand new smokers that this is aimed at so the deal is this is supposed to feel very cigarette like um, from a tactile standpoint it actually feels very papery um, the texture feels a lot like cigarette paper that's hard it's not squishy like some of the other ones aim to be cigarettes the filter it's got a protective dealy here um, a typical filter which does of course squish so think like Vapor King here um, I haven't smoked for almost three years now so I'm trying not the best judge of how well something replicates a cigarette I'm gonna take a puff here mm. green light wow that does actually quite remind me of a cigarette I'm going to have to get this in the hands of, a, of an actual smoker and, and see, but it's a lot of what I remember about smoking. It's got a smoky taste to it. Very interesting stuff. So, um, yeah, look, I'm going to write that one up for sure because that's it's actually kind of, <laughs> like I said, I'm not a smoker anymore. So that's kind of Zeus, semi-auto. So you can select between auto puff or button fire based on five clicks. Um, and a very large dial of volt. Um, these have been in the V4L staple for quite a long time. You've seen my review of the Zeus. I constantly gush about it. But take a look there. Notice anything different about these guys? Well, I'll probably give it away in the title, though I haven't named the, um, this video yet. But you might have noticed if you take if you keep track of these sort of things. These are not 808 connections. These are 510 connections. So they went with the 510 standard, uh, you know, the more popular of the standards as opposed to the 808, which is typical in um, standard e-cigarette kits. So just to show you, here's a 808 tank I actually just got. It's kind of a funky tank here. Um, so, yay, screws on just fine. I won't get too deep into these because I've done a video and a review. I'll post those down here in the description. But it's time for me to go now. So I'll catch you next time. This was Steve of Steve K's Vaping World. Have a great day, evening, morning, whatever it is. See you later. What are you doing?